You're a Roomba. You're, this is like a little baby Roomba just going Hey, GQ, how's it going? My name is Shola Maridueña, and today I'm gonna be taking you through my morning routine. Usually I get my hair out of my face and it's not always the most glamorous look. Like I don't have, I don't have the Harry Styles uh, man bun cool thing that goes on. So the first step is washing your face. Here, look, we got this. Avene, avene. So I guess let's get into it first, right? People, especially in adolescence, people were like, oh man, you need to start doing stuff for your skin. It's getting out of hand. And, and especially as I started to grow facial hair, it, it really um, started to mess up with my skin. It started off with just a, like just this, basically, just washing my face and then eventually through family, friends, and girlfriends who were, you know, not happy with just using hand soap on the face, um, I was able to kind of slowly but surely uh, level up the, the, the face game. So after that, you have this Dermalogica. Daily microfoliant. Basically what that means in layman's terms, little sand particles on your face to remove all the dead skin. Uh, this one is probably my the most fun step for me because I don't know, it just feels, it feels nice. Um, so what we'll do here is we'll put it in my hand. Yay so. Um, and then I just put like a little, a drop or two in there and then get to, get to scrubbing. Next step in the Sholo routine, we'll just call it hand sanitizer for the face. It gets all the dirt out of the pores. You're a Roomba. You're, this is like a little baby Roomba just going ee, 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 ee. Definitely be gentle, be careful around the eyes, but not super dirty. So it looks like we can move on to the next step. Vitamin C. This vitamin C is for brightening your skin. I still haven't mastered how much to do. It comes in this little vial. And I kind of just put, and then some on the cheeks, roller derby style on the cheeks, and then you can rub in. You don't need too much. You don't want it to be cakey, right? But you still want to make sure that you're able to cover everything. And then there you go. Now you're, look at you. Now you started your day with vitamins. Look at you, King. That's right. Next we have this. Now this I kind of only use in the morning time. You just get a little, I like to be gentle around the eyes. Yeah, you don't need too much pressure there. They're little, your eyes are little water balloons. Don't poke them too hard. And after that step, the eye step, comes the moisturizer step. Need I say more? Moisturize. Everyone should be moisturizing. So yeah, we're just gonna get this one everywhere. This one kind of smells like cool cucumber. I like that. Now the face looks a little rosy because you're getting the blood working everywhere. Okay, okay, and last but not least, sunscreen. Now, this is one that has kind of come into the, the repertoire more recently. Um, Cause I always, for the longest time I was like, I'm brown, I don't need sunscreen. Like, this is, this is for jokes. Um, but then my ass got burnt. <laughs> and it did not feel good. So now I'm rocking the sunscreen. Similar to the, the kind of the, the oil that we put on earlier, you wanna make sure that you know, it, you're know you covering everything, but you don't wanna you know uh, plug anything up else either. So I don't know if all of these products are the perfect ones. Like I, I switch out a lot of these all the time. It's, it's, I, I, it's probably unlikely that you find the best product for your skin on the first time. So. So, you know, don't be afraid to, to, to experiment as well. You know, finally, there is a, a bonus, a bonus level of the skin game. And these were introduced to me a little bit more recently. It's like an acne sort of, they're, they're little dots that you put on your face. So we'll open one of these bad boys up and they're pretty small-ish and they blend in pretty well with, with your skin tone. 
sometimes if I'm just like, ah, I don't care what you know is happening today, I'll just throw them on and walk them you know, throughout the day here. Like I'll throw this one on right here. Um, and look at that. Who that, you, you don't even know. You can't even see. Bada bang, bada boom. You just did it. You cleaned up your skin. Thank you so much GQ and the Grooming God segment for having me on, kind of explaining my little, my situation here. Um, I hope it, you know, uh, maybe got a couple of you guys excited about, you know, getting to work on your skin. I got a couple of things coming out that I'm excited about. First and foremost, Blue Beetle, August 18th. DC's new flick. It's DC summer, baby, you know it. Um, and also I got a podcast, Lone Lobos with my wonderful co-host, Jacob Scott Thomas Bertrand. So check that out too, if you're interested. And thank you.